So for you guys that didn't know, Southern Ontario is a very tough place to fish. I mean, everywhere you go, there's about 30 or 40 people fishing it. And that's on a slow day. So my videos are specifically tailored to the pressures and trials and tribulations of us Southern Ontario fishermen. I mean, it's tough out here. So you gotta, you gotta think different. You gotta try something different. So we're gonna do some drop shot night crawlers. I've been doing that lately and it seems to be just money. Well, I'm happy to see you too this morning, Mr. Top Hat Worm. What's up, my dude? So this is where I get my can of worms. And it, as you guys probably already know, it's just me today. And I bought three. <laughs> All right, we got worms, we got coffee. What more could you ask for? All right, see you down there at the water. All right, guys, we're here. And it is looking foggy on the water. I don't know if you can see that from here. It's 6.30 a.m. and we already got one guy here. This guy's lawn chair, so fishing. Two o'clock, this place will be just littered with people. Another important tip to Southern Ontario fishing, start early. All right, we're heading down to my spot. It's off the beaten trail, so not a lot of people head back there. Today we're running the Shimano SLX. We got 10 pound mono. Then on the uh, Spincast Mitchell 300, uh, we're running 10 pound fluorocarbon straight it's my finesse rod here this is my multi-purpose everything what a beautiful morning don't even care if i catch a bass this is just money hey buddy Oh yeah. All right, there's our drop shot night crawler set up. The way the night crawler is making my hook stay down. There we go. Ideally though, when I'm in the water, there we go. Hook facing up to a pencil drop weight. Oh, something's got my bobber. Uh-oh, better check this out. <sighs> Another bluegill? It's kind of swimming weird. Swimming sideways like a bass. That's what we can hope for anyway. Reeling all that slack. Oh, I missed it. Yep, I screwed that up. I screwed that up. What do we got here? Oh, that's a decent whatever it is. Oh, baby. Oh, no, we snagged it. But that is a nice bullhead. Oh, that is a fatty, boys. Hey, bud. Really sorry about that. Really sorry about that. <clears throat> All right, we got you in hook, bud. Hmm, I think my other pliers, this guy's too big.
Look at the head on this guy. Oh man, he's a little dirty. Give him a little rinse here. Look at the belly on that catfish. All right, off you go, Jimmy. I really thought you were a bass. Put up a good fight. What we got here? Another kitty. Another big kitty. Oh, come on, kitty. Come on, kitty. Yeah, I know, you're hungry. You're hungry. Hello. <laughs> Man, they're loaded in here. Ah, another fat one. I'd say about a pound and a half. Man, they get big in here. Wow, oh, what do we got here? Another kitty. Another kitty. Man, they're an average size here, about a pound and a half ish. Holy crap! Stop it! Stop it! I mean, fun to catch. But oh, we're after the bass here. Get you back in the water, buddy. Hook <clears throat> that bay I will unhook you. Hold on. Not the most graceful release, but we got it done. So I just got a call from the bestie, my uh, friend M, Emily. She wants to come out fishing today, so we're not very far from home. We're gonna go pick her up and we're gonna come back. Maybe she'll bring the luck. She usually does. All right, here we go again. Got a good fish, we got a good fish. Got a good one. Oh my God, no way. No way. I don't need it. Hell yeah. Oh, you wanted that walleye rig, didn't you? While I rig with a worm on it. Happy now. Happy. Oh, I'm happy now. Look at that bad boy. 
Booyaka! All right, buddy, we'll get you back in the water there. And we have a catfish. Hi, kitty. Meow. Well, one bass and like, what? Eight catfish today? He's a healthy, look, healthy looking one. Oh, well, we found out what's been messing with your bobber. All right, let's put him back in there. <laughs> wow, yeah, baby. Yeah. I'm down. Hey, okay, we got a feisty one here. We don't want to lose them. Stop it. Nice catch. Look at that. It's right down his gullet. We're going to need a plier, good pliers for this guy. Woo! Nice catch. This is why I come fish, fishing with the bestie. She got all the luck. Let's roll. Very hey, let's get some good pliers. <clears throat> okay, I can get it out. You know, swallow her. There we go. Almost said, buddy, calm down. Yeah, I got it. Whoo! Never give up. Always try and de-hook your fish, okay, guys? Bah! Just hold them for a bit so you can get a little bit of water. There he goes. High five, yo! So yeah, uh, we're catching them. Right on. Big one, big one, big one! Hell yeah! I got another kitty here. Hello, Mr. Kitty. He's a big one. Oh yeah, he's a fatty. Look at the mouth on him though. He's like just like take your finger right off. I knew you were biting my stuff. Look at that, right in the top of the mouth. Drop shot. Kitty fish. Yeah. Hey, thank you. All right, let's put you back in there. It's starting to rain. We might actually have to add out here in a little bit. They had a tornado warning. Come on. You just have it, just have it. Eat it. Oh my God. Oh goodness, we got a good one, guys. 
Not sure what it is at this point, but it is coming in and coming in hot. Woo! Hell yeah. Hello, Mr. Large Jaw. Ah, yeah. That's right. That's why I do the drop shot night crawler. Boom. Boom. Another two pounder. Third one of the day. Starting to pour it rain on me right now. What? It's just starting to rain. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, go that way. Go that way. Bye. And there he goes. Bye. Bye. I told you we caught the big bass, the bass out here. You just gotta keep putting new night crawlers on until it's not a sunfish. Yeah, mine was like. It was like a catfish head, but oh yeah. Well guys, we had a pretty good day today. Really hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me today. If you can remember to click that like button if you liked the video. Maybe think about subscribing. Anyway, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.